Hi everyone, Peter here. In this video, I'm going to take you through how you can use an app called Adobe Scan to scan in your handwritten work using your mobile phone and hand it in as an assignment on Google Classroom. So to do this, you need to download Adobe Scan and Google Classroom from the Google Play Store or the iOS App Store. Once you launch Adobe Scan, it will open up your device's camera allowing you to either manually take pictures of your work or you can set it to automatically take pictures. As soon as an image is captured, it will automatically be cropped for you based on where the edges of the pages are, but it doesn't always get this right and you can fine tune this by adjusting the borders of the crop. As soon as you press continue, Adobe Scan is ready to capture the next page of your work and you'll find that you can scan in multiple pages in very little time. As soon as you've scanned in all of your pages, just click on the thumbnail on the bottom right hand side of the screen. From here, you can preview the images you've captured. You can reorder these or go back and adjust the crop if you need to. And once you're happy with this, simply press save PDF. Another really nice feature on Adobe Scan is you can combine previously taken pictures into a single PDF to hand those in in Google Classroom. Simply press the gallery icon in Adobe Scan and then select the images you wish to combine into a PDF. Once those pictures have been imported, it's really easy to move those pages around, rotate or crop those. And once you're happy, just press save PDF. As soon as it's saved, your work is ready to hand in to Google Classroom. So to do this, just press the share button, then select share a copy and select Classroom. Next, select Attach to Assignment, and then select the assignment you're handing in your work for. And then scroll down on the page and simply press Hand In. Well, that's it for this video. I hope you found it useful. Please do reach out if you encounter any issues using this. I'm busy creating more digital learning videos, so hit subscribe to stay up to date, and thank you for watching.